Greetings, traveler. Oh, man. <laughs> We're running it back 100%. Because I already think Merlks are probably good, so... <laughs> Imagine if we get rewarded for cycling like that. Alright. Right Easy, Merlocks. Well, no, see, this is the thing, uh, Watra. What people assume is... Oh, people just run poison and then they beat big stats. No, beat big stats beat poison if you have only a slightest amount of effort, right? Like, run the blaster, run the selfless, run the cleave. Don't just run seven big guys, right? I feel like if you do that, sorry, you kind of just deserve to lose. <laughs> it's like, but I understand that as a casual player, you want to not have to think about it. It's like, no, no, no. I don't want to go through all that mental effort of building a board. Just let me make seven big guys and I should deserve the win. And I just don't think that's a very good way to balance a game. I think I buy this and roll and then hope for Sally. Oh, there's also Coin Naga now. Mm. Pass. But you have to put in, like, a very, very small amount of thought and planning to win the game when you are the bigger player. Striving for Queen plus Poison Divine Shield isn't a fun meta either. That's exactly why that's not what you're supposed to do, right? You don't just play Queen Divine Shield. If you play Queen Divine Shield, you lose to the person with the cleave. You lose to the person that has the blaster selfless. You lose to the person that has the horse with the shield on it, the reborn. Queens do not win the game if they are not supplemented by excellent minions and you only get those excellent minions if you had a good game and you were able to scale them up. Do we really want someone to get a Nomi on turn 5 and then just win because they had a Nomi on turn 5? Do we want to reduce the game to that? Because I understand that some people might want that. They get the Nomi on 5 and they feel entitled to the win. No additional brain power required, no additional skills required. Just buy elemental, play elemental. I did nothing out of the ordinary this game and I deserve to win. And if that's the case, then yeah, I mean, we have to talk about that. Because that is, that is indeed something that some people might want. And then I get it, right? I just don't agree with that philosophy at all. I don't think that's healthy for the game. I don't think it's a good way to play or balance. Let's jam the Swamp Striker for a 3, because I don't think we're going to make this work any other way. Radio start as early is great. I would love to just jam a Rat Pank against Deathwing, but this is way too good for economy. I like the other Swamp Striker. I don't think I'm going to freeze the other one. Leroy is still in? Yeah, but I mean, I'm going up against the Chenvala that had to turn 5 Nomi. All his elementals are 200-200. I have two Leroy's. Whoopty fucking do. <laughs> I still have no chance, right? I have no fucking chance. Okay, let's put it this way. If the elemental player knows how to play that endgame, you already have no chance, really. But if there is some inefficiencies in their gameplay, if they make some mistakes, they drop the ball on protected... Oh my god, that's so good for Deathwing. <laughs> they drop the ball in terms of... I didn't protect myself properly to this outcome or this or this or that. Then at least I have a chance to scam them if I have access to proper poison, proper queen, right? Not this, not this half-ass bullshit with venom. <clears throat> Whereas now, I feel like that that's not there. I feel like we're just gonna go skyfin and sell the taunts. I don't think we're gonna do much here. There's no more buddies, so I have to keep that in mind. Voon. Yeah, but to, 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 I guess to close that and um, articulate my thoughts a little bit better. If you were having a great game with Theodar, with Nomi, with Caligos, with any kind of scaling engine that makes your minions much larger than your opponents, you were incredibly favored to win that game if you know how to handle the endgame. I think that players get frustrated by losing to Poison because they don't know how to play the endgame. But losing a game because you don't know how to play is normal. That's skill. That's perfectly acceptable. It's totally normal to lose to someone that understands the end game better than you. It's not because you have a good start that you're entitled to win. <clears throat> Alright, we killed the bird. That's such a good snipe.
Oh, hey, Dr. Death. Cheers. Welcome to the Twitch end of things. Oh, nightly. Okay, okay. Sorry, I thought you said first time here. My bad. Oh, that Amalgam guy is good for this, huh? I think we are going to go Cyclone with buff. Could also roll one more here. Because they level, I think I can roll one more. Skyfin pair feels better. I don't think I'm going to bother with that. I should have cycled the Mana Saber, though. Yeah, I should have cycled the mana saber. Everything goes according to my plan. Or, uh, was it your plan? Two Tidewalkers. Oh, they have duo. Give me that duo, baby. Man, this radio star has been going out of her way to get the worst minion every time. <laughs> Where is the shitter? I see it. <laughs> I still think it's a great card, even at its absolute worst here. It's a great card, but man, it could have been so much better. Okay. Alright, we like this for sure. Eat this one. I think I level Cell, right? Let's see what I get. Pair, but I think we just... I mean, it's kind of like money, right? But this is more flexible money. Yes, I roll first. This guy's good. Oh, Mana Saber was actually kind of good there versus Deathwing. Oh, look out. Hello. Flute guy's okay, but not anymore. I think I just go with a battle cry. I feel like Honcho... I, I don't have board space for Honcho. I think Radio Star is out now. I think I'm gonna pass on Smogger. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, I should charge extra for that one. I don't think I'm gonna go crazy here. Alright. We're off to find the the base. Give me my base. So double Skyfin this time. We can get rid of the regular Swamp Striker, I'm guessing. Yeah, Flurg is gonna have a good time playing this. Flurg might be broken with uh, the new Murlocs. <clears throat> So this will go. This is getting buffed. Four left. Flute guy on the board adding nine per turn. I feel like if I get it early, it's fine. I don't think I want to bother with it right now. I think you can afford to try to high roll here. Just because you have sky fins. That's not awful, but I don't think I want to splash it. I think I'm looking for base. Base, yep. <coughs> Need the base first. Just play Seer, I think. Oh no, I get the buff. That's better. We may have to just play this at some point. I think if I don't get base by the end of my next turn, I may just have to jam it. We needed a card in the hand anyway this turn, so there's no way we tempo it. Uh, indifferent, clunk. <clears throat> yeah, I think I need a 
I either triple into Bran or base before I level. I don't really like uh, just tearing here. This card is okay. Hey, mistake, lul. All right, we got that base. A battle cry Murloc is pretty good now that I have Bream in the hand. I can buy this and triple sell end on base to get another um, three two on this. It's probably better than just wasting my gold rolling. Seeing as selling cards is quite good for me. I'm not gonna go for this triple though. Here we go. Here's the base. Yeah, Vol'jin being banned in Naga lobbies is so bad, but I'm guessing that the devs tried it with the new Nagas and they were like, <laughs> okay, that's not okay. We're going to... And, and if they... Like, they allow some pretty broken shit into the meta at the start. So if they are already like, hey, that's too much, I, I'm willing to believe them. Because... <laughs> You can just you can just tell that they tried it in the playtest and they were like, ooh, that's broken. That shit is broken. We can't allow that. Uh oh. Leapers chat. They just need to find the stealth guy and it's over. No. Actually it's no fish or anything, right? right just need to not kill the mana saber. How hard can it be? Ha <laughs> ha. Uh quite difficult apparently. Ah, uh, we are big. Hoping we're fine. Yeah, it's just a regular Baron. It's a big frog boy, though. <coughs> it will reveal itself at some point, bad, if it's its turn to attack. Go for a Bran here. Because of the Seer, I'm inclined to just take the triple now. Shady did not gift us up yet. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Um, I asked who it was and then I focused on my game. Remind me after the game, please. Because sometimes it's a random person, sometimes it's someone specific. I'm gonna go for it. I want to get the Chunker guy. I did not get the Chunker guy. How about a queen versus undead that only keeps venom for one hit? <laughs> I might actually cycle this queen to get a murloc. <laughs> Probably not, but the fact that I'm considering it is pretty fucking sad. All right, prove me wrong, queen. Carry me. I hope you win. It would be good for my franchise. Nope, seems pretty fucking useless to me. <laughs> it's such a sad card, man. Not that the old queen would have done better here, but it's so sad. Spawns without shields. I guess Reborn is the new shield. It's so much fun at the end of the turn. Surprise! Big boy. <laughs> Alright. It's probably gonna get old pretty fast, but for now, I'm uh, I'm enjoying this big boy. The big boy life. Uh, And you can make it pop out late in the fight, so all the venom is already gone by then. Just want to see what I get here. Okay, I guess I'm going to stay on this tier then. I was thinking maybe if I get a primal fin, I can play it in tier. Oh, hello. This first? It's probably not that relevant. Actually, I could I could discover it. Right? I'll go tab. Venom guy's probably good. But fuck it. Hey, here's the chunk. We found the chunk. The chunk has arrived. I 
I could get rid of a bream here. Don't think so though. I think I'm just gonna bank the shell collector. And then just play the seer. What's my positioning on this? I think I do like the venom first. I hope you win. It would be good for Keep the bream for chunk. No, I mean on the board, but yeah. <laughs> That's a chunky boy. <laughs> That is a chunky boy. Jesus. That is so good, man. Yeah. On reveal, this looked like such a bad card, but when you know that it's so easy to build a big bream and that it's actually really good to keep because of the best or the base skill, like it's yeah. It's so obvious when you see it in action. Alright, time to go to six. More base. Let's go. I guess this might be better than this, just because of how big the chunk guy gets. Yeah. Okay. I like the battle cry and the roll, but. It's probably better to pay one extra gold for a Murloc. Hmm. I don't know, actually. So we are giving away a battle pass. Myself, I am in the giveaway now because I actually did it in the wrong order. So if I win it, I'll redo, of course. <laughs> Just, you know, don't suck, chat. Don't let me win versus however many are entering because <laughs> that'll be awkward. It buffed my anomaly. No! No, chat. No. Uh oh, they found stealth. Oh, I'm bleeding. I'm gonna lose the fucking leapers because they stealth their Baron or what? Maybe not. It's a regular Baron. Let's see. Please be big enough to beat a regular Baron. I think so, yeah. They're not hitting that insane multiplication. If their comp was better, they would easily win, though. Did they even have Macaw? No, Macaw's not in. Oh, thank God, Macaw's not in. Okay, okay, never mind. Leapers are actually so weak. Macaw's not in. <laughs> Macaw's not in. Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> Playing Leapers with Macaw is not in. Kick L, dude. Three Naga. Why did they call it Coral Chonker? Uh, missed opportunities. I do want to play with Duo in some games. Maybe go like 4 out 4 play Duo. <laughs> That's still a really good card. I might not play it here just because of uh, board space. Although I guess Scour could go. Or maybe I just throw the Queen in note, note care. End of turn doesn't do anything. Oh, we found another Chonker! I think I am getting rid of the Queen, which is so disrespectful, but... You cannot have any more minions. Yes, that's why I sold one game. Come on, game, keep up now. Oh, did I already play one? Oops. I have to sell this, right? Yeah. I have to buy a card here so I can sell. I'm a The discard link does not work for you. Uh, should work. But... You mean the one in chapter? Let's see. 
Uh, Alright, so... This one works for me, obviously. Yeah, people aren't joining. It should work. Oh, what did their board look like, chat? I have no idea. It was from the giveaway link. <laughs> Give me another chalker. Nah, oh, whatever. I don't care. I'm playing pretty uh, disrespectful here. Selfless is okay. I just want to grow. Big boy coming in. Oh, Baron with uh, Bass. No, it doesn't work, right? I don't have enough units. No, I want to play Magma with uh, Element. Seems broke. <laughs> That's a big boy. That is a big boy. Jesus. That is a large boy, chat. That is a large boy. Oh, the chonker. We did it. We did it. Get chonked. <laughs> ah, it's pretty good. Mm -hmm.